Hey guys, welcome to a uh, Flintech video. Uh, today we'll be talking about uh, Cicero from the Dark Brotherhood in Skyrim and his origins as a character. So Bethesda has, um, I believe, uh, drawn a lot of references from the Cicero of the Roman times. So uh, Marcus T Tullius Cicero who was born on the January the 3rd, 106 BCE, and was murdered on December the 7th, 43 BCE. And, um, yeah, his life occurred at the same time as the decline and fall of the Roman Republic. He even had an important role in many significant political events of his time, and his writings are even available as a... Uh, uh, they're now available as a valuable source of information uh, about those events. So yeah, his, uh, his occupation consisted of an orator, lawyer, politician, and philosopher, and he often placed his favourite accomplishment as being a uh, politician. Um, but the question you're probably asking now is, uh, what does he even share in common with Cicero and Skyrim, apart from the name obviously? And um, the Cicero of the history books was uh, told to hate and despise war, following a career of law and politics instead. Um, but that obviously has nothing to do with Cicero. We know he's a uh, bloodthirsty man. Uh, a lot of his favourite quotes are even Let's kill someone! Or something ridiculous like that. Um, so, this is where these similarities start to occur. Um, we know that Cicero was responsible for executing five men without trial during his term as uh, council, the highest Roman office. Um, the men he had executed were planning to overtake the Roman state by force, and if that sounds familiar, it should. In the Dark Brotherhood campaign, you can read Cicero's journals in one of the journals. Cicero mentions someone trying to pretend they were the listener for the Dark Brotherhood, uh, the person who can commune with the Night Mother, and Cicero, learning that the man was lying, murdered him and received praise from everyone, much like the Cicero of Roman times. Uh, Marcus claimed to have single-handedly saved the Commonwealth, and Cicero from Skyrim uh, m did much the same thing, um, and in fact did single-handedly save the Dark Brotherhood. Um, yeah, this story could also uh, relate to um, the time in Skyrim where Cicero lashes out and attacks Astrid and the Argonian for treason of the law of the Dark Brotherhood. Uh, now Marcus later in his life was physically abused for sentencing the, sen the sing I don't know, sentencing the execution of those men and fled the city, then was exiled and forbidden to enter the city after he left. Uh, similar to Cicero who also fled from Cyrodiil uh, to Skyrim, uh, although Cicero did s flee for different reasons. Um, Cicero was later murdered, his hands and head displayed to the public uh, afterwards. This is the real Cicero, obviously. Uh, this correlates with the game, as you as the Dragonborn have the option to kill Cicero at the end of the Dark Brotherhood main questline. And yeah, that's basically where I found that the similarities ended. I will list the uh, sources that I had for finding this information in the description. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more videos like this, other random videos mostly because I don't really have a specific topic uh, in my videos, just kind of go with whatever I feel like doing at the time. Uh, yeah, leave a comment, love to hear from you guys, and um, yeah, thanks for watching.